Hello everyone. I'm currently in Charlotte, North Carolina. I'm staying with my mom because we're moving down here at the end of the summer and I have to go grocery shopping and kind of live on my own for the week. So I thought it'd be a good time to show you what I eat in a day. I got a few requests about it. I'm gonna show you some of the go-to things that I normally eat and it'll be pretty accurate since I get to grocery shop for myself. This is like everything that I'd buy at home and cook for myself on a regular basis. So yeah, it's about 8.30 in the morning. If I'm being honest, I don't eat this early. I usually wait a little bit, but I have a few errands to run, so I thought I would just get the day going. So I'm gonna show you what I normally eat for breakfast, which is oatmeal. It has been for a long time. I change up my recipe every now and then, but yeah, oats are my go-to thing in the morning. I like to stew some fruit in it. So I just use my hand and cook about two handfuls, maybe a little more. And this ends up being about a half a cup of oats. And then I add a banana. And all I do is peel it and then cut it straight into the pot that I'm using. Now I just add some oat milk. And all I do now is cook this on the stove top for a couple minutes. So I'll show you what it looks like. After a few minutes on the stove, you'll see the bananas start to soften up. So what I like to do is just mush them with whatever I'm using to stir. And I do this to naturally sweeten my oatmeal. I used to add protein powder, and I still do sometimes, but this is just a different way to add flavor to it. Now, if you like plain oatmeal, you can stop here, but I always add toppings because I like texture, so. This is a really good meat mix that I found. It's the only one that has little chocolate chips in it that are dairy free, at least that I know of. Um, so yeah, that's what I've been using. And I washed off a few berries. They're about to go bad, but I, I'm not afraid. looks like it's always something filling because I tend to have a lot of energy throughout my day and then I kind of chill out at night so this helps fuel me and it tastes really good as well. I'll see you at lunch. Yum. I just got back from Harris Teeter got some groceries. I think I think I'm going to make some cupcakes. So, let's go back inside. Here's the progress of the cupcakes. Looks like I'm going to make a TikTok out of this recipe, so I'll show you the final result in maybe an hour. This will be my afternoon snack, and I think once I finish this, I'm going to work out and then make some lunch. All right, I'm gonna make some lunch now. I was driving to Athens, Georgia with some friends of mine and we went to Chick-fil-A and I tried their kale salad, which was so good. I found out that it's pretty easy to make at home. There are a bunch of copycat recipes online. I also bought some tempeh, so I'm gonna throw that on top. I'll show you how I do it. So here I have some broccolini. This is just a long version of broccoli and you eat the stems, so I'm just gonna Cut this along with some kale and some cucumber.
This is the biggest cutting board I have. I have very limited resources here. And I'm just gonna break this up into little pieces. A lot of people don't like kale because it's really tough, but if you massage it, it makes it a lot easier to eat. So we're gonna massage our kale now. I'm gonna pour in about two tablespoons of olive oil. And just use my fingers to kind of rub it in the leaves. I'm gonna add in some maple syrup. A little bit of spice mix. This is just Asian salt and spice by McCormick. It kind of tastes like everything bagel seasoning. I'm gonna throw in my broccolini. And some cucumber. And I'll show you how I cook my tempeh now. Cooking tempeh and tofu is pretty easy. You don't really have to add much. I always just make it a little bit crispy with some oil and then add some soy sauce. So this has been sitting here for a minute. And I'm just gonna add the tempeh. And that'll be my lunch. So good. It hasn't been too long since lunch, but my mom just got off of work. So I think we're gonna go out to dinner. We'll do some filming in there. I gotta go. Say hi. Why? <laughs> I'm filming what I eat in a day. Well, don't put me in it. We made it. The menu is limited, but I think I'm going to get a black bean burger. So, I'll show you what it looks like when it comes out. That's very specific. Like, I look for that. So I have a few leftovers, but for the most part, that's what I ate today. And I hope you got some ideas from this, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.